When I was down to my last dime, that's when you bless me. Every time I call, you show up in the nick of time. That's when you bless me. When I was sick and didn't know if I was going to make it through, that's when you bless me. When I was going through some things and didn't know what to do, that's when you bless me. For your spiritual sports segment on Rima Gospel Radio, I am CJ. For your quick news and notes, FC Dallas has re-signed defender George John to a multi-year contract, but terms of the deal announced Tuesday were not disclosed. Oriol Sevilla is returning to Panther DRR for the 2013 Indy Car Racing season, and the team will start the year with Chevrolet. Fuzzy's Ultra Premium Vodka will be the title sponsor for IndyCar's Triple Crown Challenge next season as they will award $1 million to any driver who wins the Indianapolis 500, Pocono, and the season finale at Fontana. Plus, they will give $250,000 to a driver who wins two of the three races. Furniture Row Racing will field its own pit crew next season as a single car team have previously been using pit crews from other organizations. Rory McIlroy beat out Tiger Woods with three wins. Jason Dufferin with his two wins in the spring. Masters champion Bubba Watson and Brett Snedeker to win the PGA Player of the Year. St. John's has lost Eugenia McPherson for the season with the torn ACL in her right knee. 11th ring Maryland must play the remainder of the season without junior guard Lauren Mincy, who tore a knee ligament and wins his win over Nebraska. After going 68-24 with the Wisconsin Badgers for double-digit win seasons and led his team to the Rose Bowl this year, Brett Bielema is taking his brand of power football to Arkansas, leaving Wisconsin after seven seasons. Auburn has turned to Gus Malzahn, now former coach at Arkansas State, to restore a program that made an unprecedented fall two years after winning a national title with Cam Newton. Baylor coach Art Browse has agreed to a new long-term deal, a school source told ESPN's Joe Shad on Tuesday. After two seasons as football coach of Temple, Steve Adazio has been hired as Boston College's next football coach. Canadian businesses near NHL arenas, because of the lockout as according to a leading credit and debit card processor, spending is down more than 11% from a year ago on game day. The Washington Nationals have added a veteran presence to an already formidable rotation, agreeing to terms with Dan Heron for one year and $13 million. The Boston Red Sox agreed to a deal with free agent outfielder Shane Victorino on Tuesday for three years and $39 million. If Alex Rodriguez is unable to play in 2013 or in worst case scenario is forced to retire because of the hip injury that will require surgery next month, it would not be a total loss financially for the New York Yankees as they are insured for a good portion of the $114 million that he is owed over the next five seasons. The Texas Rangers have officially added reliever Joe Kim Soria, signing the free agent to a two-year deal with a club option for 2015, and the deal is worth $18 million. And finally, Chicago Cubs manager Dale Seavum was accidentally hit in the ear with sharpener while hunting this offseason with Hall of Famer Robin Yunt. It's all fun and games when hunting till somebody gets shot in the ear. Huh? Do you want your share of $10,000 in cash and prizes next year? Well, make sure you have your face in the place as Rima Ward Broadcasting celebrates six years on the air at their sixth annual ministry gala. Get on the payment plan to secure your tickets now by logging on to RimaWordTV.info for more information. To catch archives of your spiritual sports segment, log on to my innovative blog site, cjsports.com, and make sure you give me that follow on Twitter, at cjsports, and don't forget to like me on Facebook, at cj at that C E E J A Y. Tune in next time for more updates in your next spiritual sports segment where we sprinkle with a little spirituality <laughs> in your sports. I'm CJ. Be blessed and have a positive, productive, blessed day. And I leave you with Namaste as the divine in me salutes and honors the divine in you.